This is bottom of the barrel, where we take cheap alcohol and put it in this tiny barrel and see what happens. What I have here is Earl Settler Kentucky Straight Bourbon. I don't really know anything about this stuff. I just know that when I went to the Total Wine, I was going to get Old Grandad. Instead, they pointed me in this direction, and I was actually able to get about two and a half liters for the same price as two liters of Old Grandad. Not too mad about that. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna put this in this little barrel that I got off of eBay, and we're going to make sure it stays topped off every day and taste it around different days and different milestones just to see what happens. I think I'm gonna start off by cracking it open and let's make some observations. Now I just do this as a hobby. I'm not a professional by any stretch of the imagination, so I'm just gonna be using normal people words. I just like to use this to drown out the tiny voices in my head. <laughs> so the smell, it's super sweet and if I had to pin down two scents that it smells like. Um, sugar, that's <laughs> like a vanilla, I guess. There's a little bit of gasoline in there. And then it smells a little bit like apples. And now let's taste it. I don't know if you're supposed to like swish it around in your mouth and stuff like that. Um, I'm not gonna do that. That's what she said. It's not bad, um, it's very sweet, again, and it creeps up your nose a little bit. It's like, kind of fruity, so there's a little bit of an apple juice taste to it, um, but like the processed stuff, not like raw, organic. I don't taste gasoline in it. I know what you're thinking, that's the kind of guy that wouldn't know what gas tastes like, but you'd be wrong. I would say uh, it has a warming effect inside of me. I think it's a Wesleyan bourbon, for sure. This is nice. It's, it's nice. It's drinkable. Okay, well that's about all I have to say about that. Let's go ahead and pour it in the barrel. Bottoms up, and the double laughs. Now, we just gotta wait. We'll be doing taste tests after um, probably like a week, two weeks, just to see if these tiny little barrels can make this bottom shelf alcohol any better. Thanks for watching. If you made it this far, mom, uh, you're the best. Thanks for watching and listening to my painful uh, banter. <laughs>